In this video, I'll show you how you can slow down your clips inside of Filmora, and I will also show you how you can do some cool speed ramps to spice up your videos. Before we start with this tutorial, click the link below this video to download Filmora. Pick whether you have a Windows or a Mac computer, and then just click on the free download button. A free Filmora installer is downloaded automatically. Just unpack it, then it will do its thing and you are ready to get started. But now let's go back to the tutorial. All right, so inside of Filmora, you can see I have already prepared a clip and we'll just drag that into the timeline. And it tells us that the project setting is 1080p at 25 frames per second. And the clip that I have imported is 4K at 60 frames per second. But I just wanna keep our current project setting. So I'll just select that. So this is basically the clip and how it looks. And as you can see, this is a slow push in shot. And, and as you have seen, I shot this at 60 frames per second. So this gives us lots of opportunities to slow this clip down as we want it. The way and how this works is super simple. Just select the clip. And then as you can see here at the very right, we have the speed area. Usually you will start off here, but just select the speed area. And then we can just change the overall speed of the entire clip. And since I shot this clip at 60 frames per second and our timeline is at 25 frames per second, we can easily slow that down by 50% and maybe even a bit more than that. And as you can see right now, we have this very nice and dreamy slow motion effect, which looks really, really cool. This is how you get that cinematic look, you know, having movement combined with slow motion look and and, you know, just a very nice looking image. This is how you can do that. But let's say we do not want to change the overall speed, but maybe we just want to change a portion of the clip. We want to make it faster and slow it down. This is where speed ramping comes into play. So I have now changed the speed back to the regular speed and let's hop over to speed ramping. And here you can see you have a bunch of different presets that Filmora is offering you and you can just, you know, click on that and then you will just, you know, have a baseline. But what we want to do and what I want to show you is let's go over to customize. And there basically you have this you can imagine as being the entire video length. And if you bring this up, then it gets faster. So if we play it back, you can see it's faster. And if you bring these keyframes down, then it gets slower. And basically you can just change this as you like. You can see it's slowing down. And also if you need more keyframes, you can just bring them in by tapping on add adjustment points. And then you can again, just make it faster then make it slower again just play around with this and see how it looks you can see maybe this is a bit abrupt so we can expand this this is very cool let's bring another keyframe in oh that was the wrong one that was a freeze frame i want a keyframe so we can speed it up again maybe and then here another one we slow it down again and then if we play it back you can see we should have a very nice effect where it's slow, fast, slow again. And basically, like I said, you can just play around with that and overall create some really cool effect. If you want to get a speed ramp transition from one clip to another one, then just end the first clip with a very fast speed and then start off the next clip with a fast speed as well. And then you will have a very nice speed ramp. So there you have it, a quick overview on how you can slow down your clips and also how you can play around a bit with speed ramping and overall making your video look more interesting, very fast and very easy. If you have more questions, let me know and I'll see you in the next one.